Hi, everybody. Listen, I almost forgot to tell you guys about a very important power time that is coming up in about two days or a little bit less than two days, actually. It is called Maha Shiva Ratri. Uh, this is known as the Great Night of Shiva. This is a time where it, in, in many places in the East, I believe in India in particular, this is the time where they celebrate the uh, wedding of Shiva and Shakti together. And then, you know, different... Um, uh, religions might have a little different aspect on that, uh, on, on what Mahashivaratri represents. But according to Dr. Palai from the Palai Center, he says that this is a wonderful opportunity to change your consciousness, to even connect to the consciousness of, of Shiva. Uh, and if you know anything about Shiva, he is uh, a supreme being who, um, you know, really focuses on removing uh, karma. If you've ever seen my video on uh, where I talk about Tiru Nila Kantam, that is a mantra, Tiru Nila Kantam, uh, that is a mantra that is used to, that calls on a particular aspect of Shiva to remove uh, negative karma. So I'm not going to talk about it here, but um, so what I just wanted you to know is Mahashiva Ratri is coming up, the great night of Shiva. Uh, in the United States, it is February 18. Uh, that is a Saturday. And um, you have to check for other areas. It's it's occurring during the time of the 14th waning moon. So you want to make sure that you check that out in your AstroVet calendar or go to AstroVet.com and, you know, uh, there's an area where you can take a look at the calendar. Okay, so why am I talking to you about this? This is a wonderful opportunity for you to connect to Shiva, as I said before, and to also remove karma. Um, something, I, the... Okay, two things. I'm sorry, I have two things popping in my mind right now. So one thing is this. In India, typically this is an overnight vigil that is celebrated from like 6 p.m. Uh, or around the time that the sun goes down to 6 a.m. in the morning. Now, that is a huge time commitment. If you're able to do that and, and just meditate with a Shiva or one of the mantras like Nama Shivaya, uh, that's wonderful. You can do that. Now, not everybody is able to do that. Uh, I always say something is better than nothing, right? So um, during the Great Night of Shiva, what you can do is to uh, provide offerings to Shiva. If you know anything about the hydration ritual, um, that's pouring a water on a statue or a yantra of Shiva if you have one. Or even if you don't have any of these things, you can just use it, use a smooth stone to represent Shiva. Um, there's a process that goes with it. And I am going to show you a video. Uh, I'm sorry, in the description, I have some goodies for you guys. So make sure you read the description because there's some good stuff there. And I'll tell you about that in just a minute. Um, so this is a wonderful time to connect with Shiva and it's done during the night. So any time after the sun goes down, um, make sure that you do something, right? If it's 15 minutes, it's 15 minutes. If it's an hour, it's an hour. If you can do a few hours or the whole night, that is from like 6 p.m. to 6 a.m., God bless you. <laughs> um, the Polite Center is doing a, a, a night vigil. Um, it's not going to be the entire night, but what it's going to include is um, some hydration rituals and, and whatnot and meditation with uh, Polite Center teachers for a few hours at midnight. Uh, Dr. Polite is doing an, uh, a, a, an empowerment um, session. Uh, usually that lasts about an hour. And then after that, there's going to be a fire lab that's done by Swami Nibali, if you know who she is. So um, anyway, if you're interested in that, then you can, uh, you know, just go to polycenter.com and you can sign up for, you know, participating in their overnight vigil. Uh, it's a wonderful time to do that. Uh, if you have an interest in doing that, uh, there are people who will be joining all over the world. So it's just a wonderful um, you know, session sessions to go to. Um, if you're not able to do that, I am giving you a resource so you can do this at home. So, um, one of uh, Dr. Polite talks about the power of the mantra Nama Shivaya, and he actually has explained every syllable, um, the Nama Shivaya and what it represents. So, I have that in a document, a PDF. And I'm going to give you the link. It's in the description, like I said. So you want to check that out and you'll be able to download that. OK, you can download that onto your computer and you can use that and you can, you know, chant Namah Shivaya uh, for 
the Great Night of Shiva. The other thing that I'm going to provide in the description is a link to a recent hydration ritual that was done by Palai Center teacher Sucharita, if you know who she is, uh, on the Palai Center Practice channel. Uh, she did one just a few days ago. So you can watch that and meditate with that if you want to uh, do that during the Great Night of Shiva. So take an opportunity to do something during Maha Shivaratri. Connect with Shiva However much time you can, if you can do overnight, you can't, that's great. If you can only do a small bit of time, do something. You can do offerings too. I will also have a link to a simple ritual that I, that I have posted earlier. It's a video from, a, or not earlier today, but a, a bit a while ago, maybe a few years ago on, you know, how to make a simple offering to any of the divine beings. Um, and you can use that if you want to do that. Um, offerings are great. Hydration rituals are great. Uh, chanting Namah Shivaya. If you can do all of it, do all of it. If you can only do one of them, then do one of them, you know, or somewhere in between. Uh, but just make sure you take this opportunity, especially for those of you who are, you know, looking to increase their income or if you want a new destiny. That's a, another thing that Dr. Palai has, has said, uh, the power of this period of time. If you want to do destiny, you know, a, a new destiny, excuse me, if you want a new destiny, make sure you connect with uh, Lord Shiva. So check out the descriptions. You guys, I'll see you. Um, I'll do another video uh, probably in, in, a, in the next two weeks, but uh, have a wonderful uh, Mahashivaratri, a great night of Shiva. And may we all be blessed during that time. Namaste.